As we return to the scene next week, Alf wonders what on earth is going on as dozens of people run up to the surf club in a panic. A passing Troy tells him that there's a shooter on the loose, so Alf orders everyone to get inside as he rings the emergency services. Down on the beach, Cash holds Stevie in his arms as they wait for the paramedics. Nelson thinks they should move her up to the surf club, they're sitting ducks where they are, but Cash knows that it could do even more damage. As Cash tells Nelson to head up to the club himself, Stevie tells Cash that he should go also, but he refuses to leave her side. As sirens approach, Stevie tells Cash that she's scared, and as he does his best to keep Stevie talking, she eventually loses consciousness. Over at Northern Districts, Bree has been informed that there's a gunshot injury coming in. But when Stevie is handed over by paramedic Carla, Bree momentarily freezes. They need to work quickly as Stevie is deteriorating fast. It's mayhem inside the surf club as everyone tries to come to terms with what's happening. There's been no sign of the gunman, with Alf informing everyone that they must remain there until told it's safe to leave by the police. When Nelson tells Alf that it must have been Stevie's stalker that fired the shot, Troy searches online and discovers that Sidney was released following a mistrial. He came straight here to finish what he started, Troy angrily adds, before bemoaning Stevie for bringing this mess to their movie. Things quickly flare up between Nelson and Troy before Alf is forced to step in. Police swarming the bay, Cash rings Eden to update her, warning her to stay indoors. When she relays the news to Remy and Felicity, Remy insists on going to the hospital. Eden goes with him, with Flick returning home and locking the door. He rushes into the Ed, and Bree is forced to face her ex-boyfriend as he asks whether his new love is going to pull through. Knowing that Stevie is in a bad way, Bree initially doesn't know how to answer, before promising Remy that Stevie will be okay. But back in the Ed, Stevie quickly deteriorates, and Bree is forced to perform chest compressions. Bree desperately tries to revive Stevie through several rounds of adrenaline as Levi gently tries to tell Bree that she is gone. Bree doesn't want to give up though, having made her promise to Remy. Bree eventually has to call it, Stevie is dead. Bree steals herself to deliver the heartbreaking news to Remy, she feels she owes it to him to tell him herself. Back in the bay, as a devastated and weary Cash returns home, little does he realize that Sydney is there waiting for him.